I haven't really told anybody, you know, what to do if you've got tubers at home and you're getting ready to plant them. Um, so I just wanted to maybe show you a couple things about them real fast and then uh, and then give you an update tomorrow. So real quick, um, this is where we're at right now. We're planting a few. Uh, again, I like to wait a little longer, uh, a little later in the month to do them, but I've got some here that are kind of, eh, they're maybe not the best ones in the bunch. Um, so I figured why not put them in the ground and get them out of the shed and out of the way. And then if um, things do happen, I have, I, I'm not losing anything. Just a little bit of time. So um, we don't like to lose too much time. So I want to show you how, just how quick this can be. If that's your tuber and that's your hole, and then you put it in the ground and you cover it up and then you're done and you're on to the next one. Now, if you're in your own yard and uh, your soil is not turned or road filled or anything, you know, you may want to dig a bigger hole and turn some of the soil. But keep in mind that when you actually do plant the tuber, you don't need to read it a book or sing it a song. Um, you can actually just put it in the ground. So let's say that you've turned some soil in the garden and you're getting ready to put it in. Um, some people, again, dig a big hole, put six inches of, uh, you know, they put drainage and all kinds of stuff in the hole and then put some bone meal in there. Me, I just would make a, a line in the soil and then I would stick my tuber in it like that and I just cover it up and as long as your soil is uh, like I said loose and turned and drains well anyway which which is a good idea with tubers um, that'll be fine you don't need to really do much more than that um, the tubers will multiply they'll dig in they'll give good uh, solid um, you know almost like traction in the dirt and they won't fall over um, unless they start getting really big, at which point then maybe you want to stake them. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. When you are planting a tuber, it's a good idea to try and find the eye that's on the tuber. Um, there is no eyes here. 